A ship floats because the weight of water it displaces is equal to the weight of the ship. This upward force is called buoyancy and acts to oppose gravity. To control buoyancy, submarines have ballast tanks that can be filled with either air or water. To dive, the ballast tanks are flooded with water and the air is vented out until the density of the submarine is greater than the surrounding water. Submarines surface by forcing compressed air into their ballast tanks. When the ballast tanks are full of air, the submarine is less dense than the surrounding water and it rises to the surface. To maintain a steady depth, the submarine must maintain a balance of air and water in the ballast tanks that is equal to the density of the surrounding water. The salinity, suspended salt and chemicals, and temperature of the water affect its density. If the submarine moves into water that is saltier or colder than the water in its ballast tanks, the sub will tend to rise. Now it's your turn to experience buoyancy firsthand. Step up to the wheel and give it a try.